Hello all. So another drawing video for you. Keep your drawing skills up. So in today's video, we're going to be working on a rabbit and maybe like a little scene behind it. So get you a pen, pencil, sharpie, marker, whatever to draw with and some paper. So first thing you're going to do is you want to start out with a with a circle. Doesn't have to be perfect, just a circle. And then you're going to fill in two little dots for the eyes. Another little circle for the nose. And you're going to go down with a line, but you don't want it to touch the bottom of the circle. So you want to stop. And then you're going to curve up and curve up for a little smile. Make a happy bunny. Now, this next part, you're almost going to be drawing another circle but not quite i'm going to show you what you're going to do you want to slide over do not get too close to your first circle you got to leave room so start move over and you're going to start with a circle but you're going to go wide and go above the circle almost like you're making the number six see that almost like you're drawing the number six but not quite if you draw another circle, it's not going to work. So you start like you're making a circle, and then you come up and go wide and over to the top. Then you come take that, go here, and go down. So little bunny, his hips and his back is up in the air. He's got his face. He's got the start of the back legs. And you're going to come under here where you drew that six. You're going to curve around and back. So there's foot number one. Put some little bunny toes on it with two little curved lines. Now this next part is tricky. You're going to start here at the bunny foot. You're going to go down and you're going to curve back. But you've got to make sure that you do not touch the bottom of your circle. That could take practice. Then one, two bunny toes. Then you're going to draw a line that does connect that next foot with the head. Now, if you want to, you can do this and put a little line there so it looks like you know you got the start of the front of the leg. You don't have to, but you can if you want to. So now we got to give it ears. Now the ears can be shaped any way you want. You can do ears like this, where they go up. And they're standing up. You can do ears that go back. You can do ears, one going this way, one going that way. It's however you want to do it. So I'm going to do this one going up and back down. Real simple. I'm going to do this one going out, up, back, down. Real simple. You can make them as long as you want. Now we got a little stray mark here, a little accidental mark. I'm going to try to hide that by going curve. And down, curve, and down. Like that. Yay. Now, last thing we're missing, little bunny tail. Now, you can do a little puffball cotton tail like that, which is just a squiggly line. Do, 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 do. Or you can do this kind of tail, which is just a curved line that comes back in on itself like that. It's your choice. Whichever way you want to do it. Now, again... I made the bunnies look a little different, you know. This one's got a bigger, wider face. This one's got a more narrow face. This one's got a smaller back foot. This one's got a really big back foot. So you can do whatever you want. It's your choice. You have fun making your bunnies. So now with this, we're going to add a little detail and we're going to add uh, some more stuff around it. So pick a spot and you're going to go up. And over your bunny like that so it looks like you got a heel next pick a spot on the middle of the heel and you're going to draw a line that goes up and stops then you're going to go to that line and you're going to curve over the next line instead of starting here and making a Y you're gonna put a little bit of space and you're gonna curve like that 
Then you're going to take that line and go straight down. Now, from here, you're going to go to this point, and you're going to go one, like that, leaving space. Go straight up, two, back down, three, back over, and four. And you want to complete that. And then you're going to go big curve line up and over. Big curve line up and over. And a third big curved line and over. So now, ignoring the flying bunny, now we have a bunny with a tree and a hill. And we're going to add a bush right here. So just a little popcorn looking shape there. One, two, and three. So we got a little bush there. And we can come down here and add some grass if you want. To do grass, some of you may remember this, some of you may not. You just go one, and then come back two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And you want to make sure that when you're doing this, your lines go up and down, but they don't go down on top of each other, so you leave the space between them. And if you want to, you can go between this and add some more grass blades like that. Up, down, up, down, up, down. So it's totally up to you. So here, you got your bunny, you got some grass, you got some bushes, you got a nice little tree, and you got your heel. So hopefully you enjoyed that and I hope you were able to follow along. Remember if you get lost, you can always pause it, rewind it, rewatch it. Um, Keep drawing, keep being creative, and stay safe. Bye-bye.